It really had us with that, that cliffhanger last week, huh? But we're here! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Buster. I Shinobi. We have episode 123 of MHA today called The Ones Within Us. I'm not gonna waste any time. We're gonna see what exactly is going on since Bakugo was stabbed. Let's hop into it. I mean, there's a decent amount of blood. Oh, there's blood. I mean, if it has decay attached to it, he's like obliterated. Oh, no, it didn't. Because it was bad, but there's a chance. Oh, he caught him. He's in good hands, too. It might be fine. Oh, this is Black Whip's user. Oh, no. He's not controlling his heart. Oh, my God. Oh, shoot! Let's go, Deku! Damn! Who is this? There's a all for one. It's like he's protecting Shigaraki. Wait. No! Wait, this is the one for all animation. Oh no. If he gets one for all, like the world just collapses. This is where he met the other users. Is he getting another power? Oh. Dang, he would have lost. Dang. He is protecting him. Can't speak. Yet. The rest of like the other users of One for All? Don't you dare cut away to Cyro City. Don't you dare. I guess Makia's running. Yep. Oh, yeah, there's just a giant cloud of where he is. They're like fused. I guess because they're in the same place. Is that a skateboard? Some kind of hoverboard? I love all these little background heroes with just the, 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 the quirkiest quirks. It's too fast for the decay. That's my boy, Ida. Dang. He wants to fight no matter what. Respect, man. I said Ida, Ida been sidelined for a bit. He deserves some, some action and whatnot. The longer they wait, the bigger the shadows get. But a new day always dawns. So she's there. It's like her spirit. Okay, so since Shigaraki is here and, and all for one is like kind of manifested, she can also manifest, I guess, out of out of Deku. Transference. That's what this is. Deku's looking at him like, okay. Like he holds blame against himself? Oh. Okay. Yeah, it is like the manifesting out of their quirks. So since Deku has one for all. Every quirk he's taken, he, he can kind of tap into that consciousness. It's crazy. Are they gonna fight here? Damn, never met her, hates her. I think Zeku has to fight back in some form or fashion. Oh, right, you hate me too. He's decaying all for one. Oh my gosh. What? Ah! All for one's brother. He's a holder. What is happening, man? I feel like at the end of things, all for one is just using Shigaraki, though. Since there's some part of him left. And he's still technically alive. It's like he's, he's trying to chip away at Deku and weaken his, just his mental. Yeah. I think it's like half a mind game and half actually him gloating. 
しまったことが。Damn. Okay, her quirk was already manifested, though. He only had Black Whip and her power to like move in air and push off and levitate. He's fighting back. He needed that confidence. Woo! It's beautiful. Oh, his arm. Oh man, Shigaraki's. Oh, I guess still from the burn too. Still has it. Does he have another power now? Good, good. Withdraw! They're gonna pull back! Oh my gosh! But the fight is over! Oh my gosh! Just like that? That was a lot to take in. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, we still have the, the Makia loosened. He might be Shigaraki's, like, right out, his escape. 100 kilometers an hour, bro. Mm. But no one's gonna catch Shigaraki if, if he does completely lose consciousness. Oh, this is when he was fighting Endeavor, so they're gonna make it there in time for sure. Toga's probably still thinking about twice. Oh. Dang. Oh my. What makes them heroes? I'd be very curious to hear what Deku and, and uh, Ochako would say, say to her if she was able to ask them that question. It'd be kind of interesting. God dang. Dolores! Yeah, they weren't able to get everybody out in time. Dang. How can you prepare, though, for, like, a large-scale counterattack like this? It's so absurd. A lot of heroes. Long hair. Enhance! Speak of the devil, she wanted to talk to one of them. <laughs> this old man blush. How old is he? She's leaving! Wow, that's very mature of you, Toga. Actually. No one's gonna stop her. If she wants to leave, she'll leave. He doesn't want her to die, too. He doesn't want to lose her, too. Oh, no. He's just making sure she knows that they care about her. But she does. I think she feels the same way that this is the only place she, she fits in. I used to think she was just so crazed, but now after seeing this, this like sort of side of her, especially with twice last season, you saw a lot deeper character of who she is and how she actually feels without admitting it even to herself. But she really wants to figure out the answer to this question. Is that her? Did Froppy just get cr Oh my gosh! Was that from Toga or was that- Oh, that was just flying debris. Oh my goodness. Damn, bro, I thought they just splat Froppy. Wait, this is Toga! Wait! No, 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 this is a trap! Oh, maybe not. I figured she'd do something aside from just running up. She wants her, she wants Ochako, like, split off. Okay, maybe I'm trolling. See, may maybe this is her and she's talking about twice is the thing. I'll definitely say- God! Damn, I'm good. I'm so good. I feel like it was, like, lightly predictable. She went to put some clothes on. It's chill. Those shoes cannot be comfortable. They just can't. Those heels? He's not in, uh, not in great shape. Okay, I thought it was going to be a little bit more chill. This is probably not the way to approach it if you want a genuine answer. 
Dang, yikes! Just, it's just just that question just for just for twice his death oh no oh no well she doesn't want to kill her oh no is this gonna be like really depressing where like ochako has to put down toga and it's just gonna make me even sadder thanks so not exactly the i guess like like next step that i was expecting from this episode in terms of everything that hap just happened with bakugo but it seems like he's okay and he's safe and i guess the flashback scene with him last episode where like just before he said like I, my body moved without me thinking was just kind of like more reasoning behind why he he dove in front of deku to save him but some crazy stuff there with with all for one and one for all and more manifesting in that that sort of space i'm wondering what what deku will get next because like i said all with the only powers we've had so far are just like the strength and everything from all might and then the ability to move in air and black whip we have absolutely not even like remotely a clue on what the other powers are because even all might had them like scratched out or like didn't really have a, a real idea of the power that might be bestowed upon deku so who knows that's been it for episode 123 of our mha watch through do drop a sub on the channel if you are new and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace